It's your boy Two Wheel Monster. Um, today I have for you guys a 2009 Yamaha R1, and I'm gonna talk about my performance mods and my non-performance mods all around what I have on the bike. Um, starting with the lever guards, which are the CNC lever guard protectors, and going into levers, I got MZS short brake and clutch levers the golden kind of try to match it up with the chain and then with my sprock with my blah, not sprockets what the hell am I talking about my forks my gold forks and then moving into my phone mount which is a ram mounts about the whole thing cost about 75 bucks or something like that I think it's fantastic for using GPS or whatever you gotta use um moving down to frame sliders which are JFG racing frames, crash sliders, frame sliders, I don't care what they're called. Um, and then moving down to some of the performance stuff I have, or actually before I forget that, my Yamaha R1 on the side right here, um, my tank grips, and then my bell buckle protector for tank. And then moving to performance mods now, I have a full exhaust. It's a GYTR. It's Yamaha made exhaust. Um, I have a 530 chain, gold chain. Kind of wanted to get a little bit of gold in there and stuff like that. Um, it's a heavier duty chain, so it lasts you longer and stuff like that. And then I have a Vortex sprockets, I believe. They are 520. And then I have a 49T in the rear, and then behind this plastic cover, I have a 16T in the front, and then I think that, and then my what's the name? Oh yeah, before I forget that, my blinker eliminator, it's flash mount, I guess if that's what you call. I don't exactly know what those are, um, but I also let's see. Oh yeah, my license plate holder right here, which is hidden. But let me turn on my bike, or not turn it on. It's a. I kind of custom made it. I had like a metal thing that bent it, drilled two holes, match up with that, and then drilled two little holes, and then drilled those holes in the license plate so I can put it up, and I kind of bend it. But yeah, as far as mods goes, I think that's all I got on the bike is a chain, sprockets, changes the whole gear and I recommend for everybody. Gives it more torque and it just takes off like a beast. Oh and I also have underneath my tank over here, I have a underneath the tank inside there with the air filter. Oh I also have a Canon air filter. And there's like a mod you can do to your air box. You can kind of cut her off so you can have more air flowing in and stuff like that. I did that. And as far as that goes, I think that's all I got so far. Is levers, guard protectors, my foam mount, my tank grips, my full exhaust my frame sliders my sprockets recommend those highly recommend again gearing change in your bike what kind of bike you got I don't know but you can look it up and it tells you like what you gain either like power and torque or like the high end speed I mean yeah that's that's, that's my sexy bike right there Yamaha one